Okay, yes, I know, I'm late to the trends, as always, I'm an old man. Uh, I'm not that old, I'm 27 years old, but on the internet, that is like 27 dog years, so. I am behind on the trends, but I'm just now watching this YouTube channel called Cut, and... Boy, it is, it's something, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, uh-huh. It's something. But I found this video I wanted to react to. I haven't watched it yet, so we're just gonna watch it together, see what happens. I have no idea what's going on in this video. And uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Also, how are you? That's great, I'm glad to hear it. I'm Tom Gray, the internet's most determined Midwestern moist critical cosplayer. That's what it's all about, y'all. Okay. Woo! <laughs> This video is called Seven Lesbians Decide Who Gets $1,000. Shouts out to all my lesbians out there. <laughs> Keep doing you, appreciate you, love you, all the same. Let's see, I've watched a couple of these thousand to one videos and a lot of them are very toxic. Like this whole episode here makes me so mad. They are the meanest people I've ever seen. I couldn't even do a video about it because I would just be pissed off the whole time. I, I don't like the majority of these people. So I'm hoping this one's a little more chill. We'll, we'll see. If you end up liking this video, you can click that little button there. That's a thumbs up. That means you like it. If you don't like this video, just don't tell me. I don't need that in my life. I've got enough going on. If you really like the video and you want to watch more of my content, you can hit that little subscribe button if you feel like it. I've got a goal to hit 1,450 subscribers which I'm five away from. So let, let's make that happen. You know, that's a big ask. And without further ado, let's get right into it. Hi. Hi. Okay, before I get to know any of them, I'm just gonna pick my favorite and I'm gonna go with the one with the blue hair. She, she seems really nice. So I'm, I'm, I'm rooting for her. Well, um, my name's Charity. I don't have a job right now because the industry I do is like house cleaning and janitorial and a lot of people aren't hiring for that right now. I'm an artist here in Seattle and I recently quit my job because I got really burnt out. I recently lost my job and I'm a single parent. I could really, really, really use the extra help for like rent and bills and things. Okay, I'm Audrey. Um, I'm just financially on my own, independent. I'm like paying for rent by myself. That's my main thing. I'm just rent and tuition. <laughs> Hi, I'm Maki, and um, I was working in Seattle as a nanny, and I had been working with like my arms hurting all the time. I went to the doctor, and they told me I have tendonitis from my wrists, my shoulders. My name is Marcia. Um, the condo that I've been living in for the past three years, the landlord has decided to sell it, so I need to find a new place to live. Well, I'm Claire. I've always wanted to build a small, sustainable dome home, so I would put this into savings to buying some land to build my tiny, sustainable dome home. Okay, Claire, you're gone. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need a thousand dollars so I can build a dome home. Dome home. That's what I call. That's what I call my bedroom. You know. God damn it! I'm sorry. <laughs> Take her to the dome home. <laughs> no, a, a lot of these people have like real reasons. Like they lost their jobs. They that one girl has tendonitis, and then you're over here like I want to live in a dome home. So I'm gonna use that to put into savings. No. Okay, I'm sorry, Claire. You seem nice, but I really don't want you to win. <laughs> I mean, is this the vote, that, or are you eliminating I mean, yourself? I mean, I mean, I think I think they do need it more than me. I'll vote myself. Okay, she voted herself off. I, I respect that. There's, <laughs> I would have been a lot more upset if she was like, no, I really need this thousand dollars for my dome home. Dome home. I'm not leaving. <laughs> what do you all think of Claire voting herself off? I think it's noble. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. I don't think it's like. If yeah, if I was in your situation, I would also vote myself off. Yeah. So I understand. Okay. <laughs> if I was in your situation, I would also vote myself off, but I'm not, so I'm gonna stay here. 
I mean, I have a couple questions for you. Okay. Uh, where does your girlfriend live now? Uh, she lives with family. Okay, she lives with family. I don't know. Like, because I'm, I'm, now I'm just like getting like nitpicky and stuff, but like a condo in Seattle is really expensive. That puts in question like your salary is like probably more than other people who like rent rooms and things and like you might have other options. I currently have a roommate who helps. Yeah, there's something about this girl, Eden. I'm getting bad vibes. I don't know what it is. She hasn't been that rude yet. I just, I think I can read people well, and I don't think I like her. So you had mentioned that you were just feeling a little bit burnt out. Yes. And so you decided to quit your job. Yeah. And so that's why you need the money. And so that was a choice. Could you tell me a little bit more about like what motivated that? I was just burnt out, so it was a personal choice. I mean, I wanted to win a thousand. She's gone. <laughs> She's gone. <laughs> right as soon as you're like, Oh, I was I was burnt out. I wanted to quit my job, which don't get me wrong. You could do that. That's totally okay. But then whenever people are fired or because of COVID, their job just doesn't happen anymore. I don't I don't think that holds up to be like, yeah, I want to do art and I quit my job to do that. Like, okay. Hello. Like, okay. Um that's awesome, but you, sh you should have a, uh, a backup plan. I understand that burnout is real. I feel it all the time, but... Can you not? I love you, but can you not? Thank you. I understand that burnout is real, but compared to people who lost their job during a pandemic or have a child, just quitting your job because you were tired of it and now you want to put art on tote bags. No, I, I, I would say she's got to go. <laughs> I didn't realize like when everyone started telling their like story, I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, I, I can, uh, I can uh, sit this one out. Well, I mean, is this going to be a competition of who's just not worthy till we get to the last one? Is that what's going on? Yes, Charity, it is going to be a competition. That's unfortunately how the game works. Also, I feel like this game is kind of bullshit anyways, because th this channel cut they have almost 11 million subscribers, so they're not hurting for money. They, they could pay each and every one of these people like $5,000 if they really wanted to, but they want to do their own little cute version of Squid Game. I don't, I don't know. At least no one's dying in this one. I would be interested to know what Claire thinks. I think... Why do you think her? <laughs> she obviously like doesn't know what her name is. Ah, uh, that one, that one right there. Uh, yeah, her. <laughs> I think I will vote myself off this round as well. Thank you. So far they're being really sweet. Just like, yeah, you're right. I'll vote myself off. I kind of like this. I respect that of people. When they're like, you know, my struggles aren't really as intense as yours are, so I'll sit down. First off, how was that last round? What was the, you think was the hardest part so far? I mean, probably not getting $1,000. That's, that's probably the hardest part. Who would you take on a date? Is that for me? Yeah. How does that narrow it down? Hey, hey, who do you want to fuck? That'll help you decide, right? Who, who do you want to have sex with? You know, this, is, this is for people getting money. Who'd you take on a date? I don't know, all of them? If I had $1,000, we can all go to Applebee's, get a, get a two for 10 or whatever. Uh, do we want to do like a game or something? Or do you feel like you guys know who you want to vote off in this one? I know who I want to vote off. Yeah, Eden is just like, I know who it is. I know who I'm voting off. Like, I'm sticking with it. I don't like her. Final four. Just a reminder, this is the last general elimination round. You have been doing it based on need. Everyone agrees a lot of you need this money, so do you want to do an activity for this last one? At this point, it's if, you're, if you really want to battle needs against needs, that's going to be a lot of pros and cons. I gotta say, Charity's fit is so sick. I love this fit. The shoes matching the shirt and the pick in the hair matching the shirt. That's dope. I, I would give her the money just because her outfit is sick. Your need weighs any more than her need, weighs any more than her need if you guys break down. I disagree. I have a whole ass kid to take care of. And she has a whole ass kid to take care of. A whole ass kid to take care of. Now, kids are a handful, but an ass kid? A kid that's just entirely an ass? Oh my god, imagine the diaper bills alone. We can all go across and like vote, or not vote, but like guess each other's signs and then we'll reveal at the end who, who got like, them right? Okay, okay, okay. 
Why are they doing this? I get it's a thing of chance, but I'm not a fan of star signs. I, I don't get it. Maybe it's because I'm a guy. I just don't understand it. Or it's like, you're such a Leo. I, I don't know. Can you tell what I am? Guess. Comment below, and if you get it right, I'll give you a thousand dollars. Disclaimer, I will not be giving you a thousand dollars. I think you are a cancer. That's fun to take out of context. I think you are a cancer. And not in like the star sign way. I, I think you're cancerous. And some facts were said and asked and it doesn't quite add up all the way. So I was gonna pick <gasps> What do you mean it doesn't add up? All these questions, it was kind of just seemed like like on on the spot type answers. What are you saying? I don't know that she might be lying. About what? About a kid. Yeah, the kid is real. It's an ass kid. That thing's shitting all over the place. Okay, kid is real. Yeah, we all, we can sense this. You know, lies. Okay, now nah, it's gonna be charity. What did charity do? Ch Charity's the nicest one out of all of them. She seems so sweet. Charity, how's it feel joining the couch gang? Good. Stop at. How's it feel to join the couch? It feels great. I just lost my chance to win a thousand dollars. We're being honest. A thousand dollars is it's a lot of money for a lot of people, myself included. If I just got gifted a thousand dollars, that would be awesome. So yeah, I wouldn't be like, this is great. I'm so glad I lost. I mean, I think that the people who played the game the best are currently left. Played the game the best. What do you mean? I feel like it's it's very much a lot of still playing the game. Like, it is a pity party against a pity party, and who believes that their struggle is better than everybody else's? She's so right. This game is all about who can make other people feel worse about them. Everyone's struggles are just that. Everyone's struggles. They're, no one's struggles are greater than other. Well, that's not true. I mean, you know what? I'm wrong. <laughs> that's not true. Some struggles are way worse than others, but still. I'm ready to vote whenever I feel like I knew. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think Eden should get the money. I agree that Eden should get the money. Yeah. You do have a dependent. Right. Eden gets the money. <laughs> I, I knew it would be the one I didn't like that wins. That's always how these go. The person that I don't like wins. What is this? Thank you for feeling bad for me. <laughs> Fuck off. Thank you for feeling bad for me. You could just say thank you. What it thank you for feeling bad for me? I would be like, actually, no, never mind. Give it to the other girl who needs surgery on her fucking arms. Give it to her, not the girl with the kid. How do you feel? I don't know. It it feels weird, but yeah, I'm thankful. So thank you for feeling bad for me. <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! Like, did anybody like learn anything during this process? Yeah, life is hard. <laughs> and living is really fucking expensive. That's yes. what I'm continually learning every year. <laughs> this show taught you that life is hard? Doesn't, doesn't life just teach you that? Okay, that's a cut. Woo! Okay, so the person I disliked the most got the money. Charity, the one I liked the most, did, did not. And the girl who probably needed it the most, who like has to have surgery on her arms, didn't get it. So yeah, this video didn't do anything for me. Uh, actually made me feel worse about life in and of itself. So if that's what they were going for, mission accomplished. Okay, I can't do it anymore. Bye. So home.